What's going on guys, my name is Renegade, today we're here for AQW News. Now before we get into the news, I just got a couple of announcements to make. First of all, my guild is recruiting, my new guild Perception. Um, I've made an application process that you guys can go through, so if you guys go to the link in the description for applications, you guys can click on that link, fill out the application, and you're in the, I guess, the draw to be uh, accepted into the guild. There are currently 57 applications, and I'm going to be inviting 40 people. I've already got 10 people in the guild, so there'll be 40 people invited um, to the guild. So you've got a pretty good chance of, of getting in as long as you fill out the application, honestly, and just, um, you know, give, give as much detail as you can and such, and you'll, you'll have a pretty good chance of getting in the guild. Now... Related to the guild, I have a Discord server, if you guys didn't already know, um, which has been going for a while now. Um, I'd always enjoy to have more people to talk to from uh, from my channel, so that'd be great if you guys could join that. Um, that's link in the description. That'll also be the guild Discord server. Now, the way I'm going to have that working out is I'm going to have like a role for people that are in the guild, and only those people that are in that role can access the guild uh, voice channel and the guild text channel. So there'll be like a separate kind of, you know, place where you can interact with other guild people if you are in the guild there so join that if you have made an application then i highly suggest you do join the uh discord server but with that out of the way let's get into the news so we've got some tweets from abelina is where i'll be covering this week um so first of all she did tweet some stuff to do with this week's event which will be something to do with the rift now she said this friday heroes from across law head to the rift to guard to study to defend and to fight the monsters coming from the rift now what's important here is the fact that she's specifically She's specifically uh, differentiated three different things. To guard and defend, to study, and to fight. So, um, there, I believe it, it's it's giving off a vibe of having three different factions doing three different things, which has like been like a theme throughout the last couple of events. Also, she made a follow-up tweet saying, Friday, meet Lawmaster Emily, Shadow Falls monster specialist, and talk Drakath sometimes Bard at the Neverglades camp near the Rift. Now, both these, these characters are obviously NPCs, so players can interact with them in a friendly manner, right? So, Lawmaster Emily, Shadowfold, so it's evil. Drakkar, sometimes Bard, so chaos. Now, you can interact with these two people, which indicates that, hey, these two people are NPCs that you can interact with and possibly do quests from and shop and stuff like that. So, because these two people are uh, friendly, then it tends to give off the vibe that there's going to be different factions doing different things. So, back to the original tweet, which was, to guard, to study, to defend, and to fight. So the guard and defend will be obviously the chaos because the rift is obviously due with chaos and chaos monsters. So chaos, the chaos players will be uh, guarding and defending. Uh, to study will be what I think will be uh, evil because Lawmaster Emily seems like the kind of like a character, like a teacher. You know, she's got glasses on and she's got like holding like a scroll. So that stereotype kind of like fits with like a teacher. So you'd be studying if you're evil, and if you're good, then you'll be fighting, because that's the only one left, and so that generally is the vibe I'm getting from here, that's just a big guess, I don't know, but uh, either way, that's what, the way I think it's probably going to work out, if not, then it's a, it's a pleasant surprise, I suppose, um, but either way, that's it for what we've got to do with that event, now, tying in with that event, Quibble is coming back to AQW, now, there are a couple of really interesting items that I saw, I'm really into bank pets, and I collect them, I don't ask why, I actually kind of regret it now, it's been a lot of ACs on that, on that stuff, but uh, there are two bank pits as far as I know, one of which is just Quibble, uh, who's like really like menacing looking, real evil looking, um, quite a dark looking character um, here. His teeth are like all pointy and stuff, he's got like black eyes and it's just real menacing. Um, and he's got wearing a backpack so that'll be a bank pit. Um, and then, of course, uh, above that, more, more recent tweet, is uh, a picture of that same Quibble standing inside a mimic chest so if you don't know what a mimic chest is it's a chest that's kind of like alive and it like has like teeth and stuff and when it opens it like its teeth are exposed and stuff like that and it walks around and has like arms so yeah it's a, it's it's quibble standing inside a mimic chest so i imagine it might be two kscs for, for either one of those or it might be two kscs for the just the quibble on its own and then five kscs for the quibble inside the chest either way uh there's two new bank pits coming um you never know one of them might, might involve quests you never know but uh either way that they both look really cool now, there's a couple of sets that have been teased as well. There's a Dragon Slayer General kind of vibe I'm getting from the one on the left there. It looks kind of Dragon Slayer General-esque, and it was like a dragon-themed helmet. It looks kind of smaller than the Dragon Slayer General helmet, but it does look like it's uh, based off of Dragon Slayer General, and so that'll, that looks really interesting. Kind of like it gives off like a Dage vibe as well, but it's not like blue enough, I think. It's not, not exactly like, like brimming with Dage features, I suppose. And then on the right side, there's just some like random new set. I don't know what that has to do with. It's probably to do with the Rift, to be honest, but uh, I don't know. It's not really giving me off a specific vibe from somewhere else, so that's just something new, I guess. So yeah, that's, that's pretty cool coming out this Friday. If you guys did enjoy the video, leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.